So <clears throat> after four hours of flight um, from Singapore to Kaohsiung, um, we have finally landed and we've checked into the hotel. Um, this hotel is called Airline Inn. I have to say it's quite a pretty nice hotel. I don't think you can see anything. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to show the room later. So, so we check in, freshen up, then we're going to head out to the next destination uh, maybe I'm just going to bring you through what I normally bring with me when I'm traveling so um, I try to keep things really simple when I'm traveling because uh, I mean essentially it's just to keep the luggage really really light so okay um, let's look at the things that I'll use in a day so I got Beauty Water, which is Sun and Park. Um, this is the one that Fiona gave me. So if you have watched the beauty vlog, so I'm using this in a day. Followed by, now I'm trying a new vitamin C serum for our new vlog. Um, sorry, I'm trying to dig that vitamin C. Oh, it's here. So it's um, Claris. It's the pure vitamin C with Centella Asia Thicker Extract, whatever that is. So I'm trying this. I'm on its um, third or second or third day, if I remember correctly. Followed by the usual, um, the day I'll use uh, red erasing cream. Um, now I've switched to another sunblock, which is the La Roche Posay. Um, highly recommended by another friend of ours so I'm trying this for the day so this is my day routine um, night basically <clears throat> I'm using the same thing as in what I'm doing in Singapore um, I'm using the full range of Haku I brought the full range of Haku which is under Shiseido um, along with me for the trip eye cream or eye serum wise is Cora which we sort of like recommended in the last vlog and I bought it just to try uh, other than that pretty much the same I brought a cleansing oil just to remove the makeup sorry makeup just to remove the sunblock um, <clears throat> okay so now let's get ready to go out Oh! 
This one looks interesting. Huh? Oh, Tainan rice. Tainan, Tainan. at Tainan and it's a really short trip it's like 10 minutes and we're here so we have checked into our Airbnb and now we are on the way to lunch uh, going to this place called Gong it's not a Hong Kong Gong Zai. Uh, Gong Zai Rou Zao Yi Mian. So basically, I think Yi Mian is a Tainan specialty. So we are aware the origin of the dishes. Um, I've tried it in Taipei. I really like it, and it resembles it resembles a little bit of um, there's a Singapore Yi Mian as well. It's deep fried. It has this very nice, robust flavor. So we're going to try it later. If I can't be be your love then I have to play the friend Daggers on for your heart. I will contend. You're a wild one, and you need to be set free. So just say the words, and I'll come running, and we'll. Morning. This is day three, and we are in Tainan still. So we are on the way to breakfast. Um, this place called Ah Tang Xian Zhou. Uh, we are staying in this district. It's quite a quiet area. Mm, impression of Tainan is it's quite a laid back place. I mean, most of places in Taiwan is laid back uh, compared to Taipei. I would say there's a lot more character to Tainan compared to Kaohsiung and the food is a lot more exciting um, I would much prefer Tainan at this stage so let's see how the food like so we managed to get a cab let's go Just say the words and I'll come running. Just a 
to the most exciting part of the trip and that is to South Drive from Tainan to Kateng if you can see that is the car with their drive um, a little bit scared because I've never driven out of Singapore and I kind of like uh, pay attention to the traffic here it's a little bit less orderly compared to Singapore so finger crossed that we're gonna reach Kateng in time night market. This is supposed to be one of the bigger ones in Taiwan because it stretches for 2.4 kilometers so we are at the start of the market. Um, this is still not considered the peak of the market. There's like a really town center like right in front so we're just gonna walk around and see what's available here. Now we are on the way to this area called Chu Huo where we are supposed to do fireworks If you can see from far there's like Oh my god This is like super dark And from far you could see like there are actually people doing all the fireworks okay apparently this area it's like a natural there's a lot of natural gas so it keeps burning. So, what is in Shima? Keeping Shima. This is a good thing. We can see it here. It's actually quite funny. Good idea. I think it's barbecue. <笑>是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊是啊
today is day five <laughs> i think so totally lost track of time so uh well anyway today is the second day at uh Kenting. we are going for a hike so i've washed up and we are going down for breakfast and i hope the hike is going to be scenic um the view outside the room looks really calm and peaceful with the exception of an election poster which sort of like you know disturbed the whole scenery but anyway so um, time for breakfast Just now when I was hiking, I actually tripped and fall. <laughs> <laughs> I think it because I was vlogging and I didn't pay attention to, to what I'm stepping on, so I had a trip. But it's okay. It's actually quite funny. <laughs> 